Class 6, Science, Chapter 3, Fiber to Fabric Animated Science, Introduction There is a variety of clothing material of fabric such as cotton, jute, silk, wool, polyester, nylon, acrylic, etc. Fibers are obtained from two sources, that is, natural sources, plants and animals, artificial or chemical sources, like petroleum. Fiber Fiber is a hair-like strand or thread from which cloth is made. Fibers are flexible, can be spun into yarn and made into fabrics. Fibers naturally occur in both plants and animals. They can also be prepared artificially by humans by chemical methods. Yarn A yarn is a continuous strand of twisted threads or fibers of natural or synthetic material. Fabric a fabric is a cloth produced by weaving or knitting textile fibers. The various types of fabric are cotton, silk, linen, jute, wool, polyester, nylon, acrylic, etc. Types of fibers Natural fibers The fibers of some fabrics such as cotton, jute, silk and wool are obtained from plants and animals. These are called natural fibers. Cotton jute, coir, linen, are some examples of fibers obtained from plants. Wool, silk, hair, fur are obtained from animals. Wool is obtained from the fleece of sheep or goat. It is also obtained from the hair of rabbits, yak and camels. Silk fiber is drawn from the cocoon of silk worm. Synthetic fibers The fibers of some fabrics such as rayon, nylon, polyester, acrylic are prepared artificially by humans by chemical methods. These fibers are called synthetic fibers. Types of natural fibers Fibers obtained from plants Natural fibers are obtained from the various parts of the plant such as plant seeds, leaves and stems. Example, cotton, jute, coir, linen, etc. Cotton Cotton fiber is obtained from the cotton plant seed, pod. Cotton plants are usually grown in places having black soil and warm climate. The fruits of the cotton plant or cotton balls are about the size of a lemon. After maturing, the balls burst open and the seeds covered with cotton fibers can be seen. From these balls, cotton is usually picked by hand. Fibers are then separated from the seeds by combing. This process is called ginning of cotton. Uses Garments, upholstery, wicks for candles, rugs, swabs, etc. Jute Jute fiber is obtained from the stem of the jute plant. It is cultivated during the rainy season. In India, jute is mainly grown in West Bengal, Bihar and Assam. The jute plant is normally harvested when it is at flowering stage. The stems of the harvested plants are immersed in water for a few days. The stems rot and fibers are obtained by hand. Uses packaging, bags, sacks, wrapping materials, garments, rugs, baskets, etc. Coir Coir is obtained from the outer covering or the husk of coconut. Uses Doormats, ropes, mattresses, brushes, fish nets, etc. Linen Linen is obtained from the flax plant. The flax plant is either completely pulled out of the ground or cut close to the root and the seeds are removed. Fibers are loosened from the plant stalk and the woody part of the stalk is removed by crushing it between two rollers, leaving the fibers exposed. Shorter fibers are combed away, leaving only the long, desirable flax fibers behind. Uses towels and aprons, garments, table coverings, bed coverings, curtains and other household textiles. Fibers obtained from animals Natural fibers such as wool, silk are obtained from animals like sheep, Angora goat, Angora rabbit, Kashmir goat and animals of the camel family. Silk is obtained from the cocoon of silk worms. Types of synthetic fibers Rayon Rayon is obtained by chemical treatment of wood pulp. This fiber is called rayon or artificial silk. Although rayon is obtained from a natural source, wood pulp, yet it is man-made, synthetic fiber. Rayon is mixed with cotton to make bed sheets or mixed with wool to make carpets. Nylon 
Nylon is prepared from petroleum. We use many articles made from nylon, such as socks, ropes, tents, toothbrushes, car seat belts, sleeping bags, curtains, etc. Nylon is also used for making parachutes and ropes for mountaineering. A nylon thread is actually stronger than a steel wire. Polyester and Acrylic Polyester is another synthetic fiber. Fabric made from this fiber does not get wrinkled easily. It remains crisp and is easy to wash. So it is quite suitable for making dress material. Terylene is a popular polyester. It can be drawn into very fine fibers that can be woven like any other yarn. The story of fiber to fabric. Fiber to yarn, stage 1. The process of making yarn from fibers is called spinning. In this process, fibers from a mass of cotton wool are drawn out and twisted. This brings the fibers together to form a yarn. Spinning can be done by using a takli or a spindle, a charkha or a spinning machine. Yarn to fabric, stage 2. There are many ways by which fabrics are made from yarns. The two main processes are weaving and knitting. Weaving. The process of arranging two sets of yarns together to make a fabric is called weaving. This whole process of arranging two sets of yarns at right angles to make a fabric is called weaving. Weaving is done on looms. Hand-operated looms are called hand looms and power-operated ones are called power looms. There are many types of weaves used to make different kinds of fabrics like cambric, poplin, mat, satin, velvet, towels, denims, etc. Knitting The process of making a fabric by intertwining a single yarn or thread in a series of connected loops is called knitting. Knitting is done by hand, knitting needles or machine. History of clothing material In the Stone Age, most clothing was made of leather or fur or woven grasses. By the Bronze Age, people learned to weave twigs and grass into mats and baskets. Vines, animal fleece or hair were twisted together into long strands. They learned to spin yarn on a spindle and to weave cloth out of the yarn on looms. The early Indians wore fabrics made out of cotton that grew in the regions near the river Ganga. Although many clothes, especially coats, were still made out of the leather or fur, most clothes were made out of wool from sheep or linen from the flax plant or cotton. Some rich people wore silk. In the Middle Ages, the medieval period, people invented the spinning wheel, which made spinning yarn go about four times as fast. The early Indians wore fabrics made out of cotton that grew in the regions near the river Ganga. In ancient Egypt, cotton as well as flax were cultivated near the river Nile and were used for making fabrics.